Hey guys, Lord Oshawott here, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Crystal. In the last episode, apart from boring commentary, we got our sixth badge and made our way to here to Mahogany Town. In Mahogany Town, we went to the Lake of Rage, discovered that the Red Agar Gyarados was angry, uh, and found the Rocket Hidden Base here. In this episode, we're going to be taking on the Rocket Hidden Base. Now, you can fight all the rockets for experience if you want. I'm going to do experience elsewhere off screen. Uh, Lance, it takes two passwords to get into the boss's quarters. Those passwords are only known to a few rockets. The rocket there very graciously told me so. So, let's go get the passwords. So, you want to go all around the entire base looking for passwords. You can also get some good items here. We Here we find a full heal. Awesome. Um, I th you can go up the stairs, get a password. We get an item ball here. We get an ice heal. Excellent for what's coming up. So if we go in here, we, there's a Sightness we can fight, there's a Rocket we can also fight. We've got some Item Balls here. Here we get Protein, but we can't carry any more items. So uh, let's have a look at our item list and see what we can get rid of. Um, whoa, well, that's a lot of stuff. Um, wow, that is a lot of stuff. But well, how about we get rid of our berries? So let's just check out our berries. Because uh, I, we, at this point, we really don't need these. Uh, I say that now, they could be my famous last words. So here we have a, obviously the protein. Um, obviously, like I said, I'll be giving items like that to Pokemon that I think need them. Trying to avoid this rocket here. Yuck, yuck, yuck. You challenge me to a battle, huh? You're nuts, but you have guts. I like that. You can beat me. I'll tell you a password to the boss's room. So, um, this guy's gonna give us a password, huh? Rocket Gun's gonna send out Radicade. So, uh, we'll just make sure it works. Radicade, uh, a bear fling wheel could do it for us. Uh, no real of them. Danger of this. Akamaru grew to level. Nope, he didn't grow a level. I thought he was gonna grow a level. Yuck, 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 good. So, here's an X special. We don't really need X special. Um, talk to this guy again. Yuck, yuck, yuck. The passage the boss's room. Uh, I think it's Radicate Tail. So, um, with that recognition, we uh, have one password already. Um, the other password, like I says, is held by one of these rockets here. So we talk to this rocket here. Do I know the password? Maybe. No, we can just gonna get it. So here we have a rocket grunt. Who's going to start things out with Ekans? So Akamaru, like I said, is going to be the key player for a while. Awesome. And then set up Gloom. We can make sure we're at Gloom. We don't even have to use Flame Wheel, I don't think. So let's just use Ember. Awesome. Takes care of Gloom. Alright, stop. I'll tell you. So what I want to do, talk to the rocket again. Pass through the boss's room. Slowpoke's tail. It's useless unless you have two passwords. Now luckily we fought that rocket earlier and got the password. I'm glad that rocket actually caught us because I wouldn't have thought that he has the password. Anyway, let's take these stairs. Now that we have the passwords. Come this way, there's nothing down there of great importance. It's a bit of a foreshadowing room. We can dodge this rocket because he stupidly turned away. Um, come down here and be interrupted by Silver. Didn't I tell you I was going to destroy Team Rocket? Tell me. 
Who is the guy in the cave who's dragon Pokemon? My Pokemon were no match at all. I don't care that I lost. I could beat him by getting stronger Pokemon. That's what he said that bothers me. He told me that I don't love and trust my Pokemon enough. I'm furious that I lost to a bleeding heart like him. Hm, I don't have time for the likes of you. And he smacks us for some reason because of the asshole that he is. Here we get another Ultra Ball, which is going to come in handy very soon. Uh, we just use two passwords on this gate. Um, the door will open. And we now can fight this Rocket Executive. Giovanni, suspended Team Rocket years ago. He has been in training, but we're certain he'll be back someday to assume command again. That's why we're standing guard. I won't let anyone disturb this place. So like it says, just fight this rocket here. Shouldn't be that too difficult. The Senate of Zubat, um... Okay, I thought you would have had better Pokemon. Just Flame Wheel. And make short work of that Zubat. And we're some we're gonna get a level here, so we're <laughs> we'll stick with Akamaru. Another flame wheel. Should take care of Raticate. And it did not Wow, my estimates are amazing in this video. Bang goes Radicate. Uh, Akuma grew to level 36, so uh, we're getting there, we're getting there. He's about to send out Coughing for his third and final Pokemon. We can make short work of Coughing, just use Flame Wheel, I guess. Like we have been doing from the very start. Excellent. So that rocket executive was defeated. Could do a thing. Giovanni, please forgive me. No, I can't let this affect me. I have to inform the others. He's gonna run into a table and then leg it. Now if you turn to this micro, the password is Hail Giovanni. We now have a password to get into the room where the vault where you saw all those vault orbs. Up here we have an item ball, we got TM46. Um I no idea what TM46 does. Um Faith! Uh no, I am not gonna teach Faith to anyone. That is a horrible move. Um so we just make our way back to the room where we had the pass where we got the password for. Just take these stairs. And these ones. Uh yeah, I forgot I battle that guy. Two sec. Well I made short work of him. Anyway, if we have the we've got what we have the password. Input the password. The door will open. Step forward. Hold it right there. We can't have a brat like you on the loose. It's harmful to Team Rocket's pride, you see. However strong you may be, you can't take both of us at the same time. Sorry, baby. Now get ready to be thrashed. Ho 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 ho! Hey, don't be selfish. Spread the foot around. Yep, plans to help us. So, um, we're going to be taking on another rocket executive. The female one this time. So, um, we can make short work of her Pokemon too. I believe she has mostly, uh, poison, like an Arbox and the Glooms again, like the rest of them. So, um, Akimaru. Abusing Flame Wheel, I guess. Uh, we're going to be abusing Flame Wheel quite a bit for now. So, uh, critical hit! Wow. Um, so 
surprised about criticals. He's actually getting. I'm getting quite lucky with criticals. Um, it's going to be sending out Mercro. We're going to. Yeah, we're going to change to. No, we're going to stay where we are. We're going to we're going to stick with Agamaro now that I think about it. So let's use a flame wheel. Fusion flame wheel. Awesome. Let me send out gloom. Um, this is not a problem. Just use ember. Seriously. And we're done. We're beating this rocket. Do 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 do. do. Join Team Rocket, we could have become an executive. Um, no thank you. This hideout is done for. But that's fine, the broadcast experiment was a total success. Doesn't matter what happens to this hideout now. We have much bigger plans. You come to appreciate Team Rocket's power soon enough. Show yourself while you can. <laughs> Do it all the rockets, yeah, but I'm concerned about the young guy I battled in the process. Sorry, Gold. I'm sorry how well you were doing. So I just hung back. Now all there is left to do is turn off that odd radio signal. So he checks it out. Is this machine causing all the problems? I don't see a switch on it. We have no choice. We have to make the electrode faint. Yeah, you can't catch these electrodes. So if you want an electrode, I'm afraid the time now to get one isn't here. To take the job. We have to take on this side, so uh, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to make all these electric faint, and I'll see you in just a moment. Okay, I'm back. I've made the electric faint. Uh, Lance, that odd signal has finally stopped. The lake should be back to normal. You're the hero. Let me thank you on behalf of all the Pokemon. Oh yes, you should take this. I found it here, but I don't have any need for it. We received HM06. Awesome. That's well cool. Teach it to a Pokemon to get across wild water. And keep in mind, this in mind, you can use that out of battle only with the badge from a Hogany Town. So basically, to get the badge we can use Whirlpool. I'm not going to be teaching Whirlpool to anyone. I'll probably catch a random water type just so I can have the basis of Whirlpool to be used. Okay, we're done here. Everything cleared up. We can just take this. What well, right at the beginning is being very lazy as we are. I'm gonna heal up the guys, and we're gonna be taking on Mahogany Gym. So, like I said, you can heal my Pokémon. Yada yada yada. Yes, please. Keep pressing the B button so we don't speak to her again. Fully heal. We'll see us again. Now, Akamaru is still going to be our key player. Because... Price is a veteran who has trained Pokemon for, for some 50 years. Said to be good at freezing opponents with ice type moves. Yep, this is an ice gym. And we have to fight some ice trainers. Now, what I'm going to do is uh, I am going to off-screen all of the trainers here and show you the route you will take to get to Bryce or Price. See you guys in just a moment. Alright, now I've beaten all the trainers. Basically what I've learned is to take this one. Obviously you'll fight that guy. Go all the way here, here, there, that, then that one. Go along to this one and go up. You will fight this guy if he looks at you because he keeps doing that. And then just along there, and here is Bryce, or Price. I have seen so bad much in my life. So I'm your elder, let me show you what I mean. Be with Pokemon since you, before you were born. You do not lose easily. I, Price, the Winter Trainer, shall demonstrate my power. Ice Gym Leader, Price, is a bit of a red herring. He does actually have Pokemon with water moves. For example, Seal. Um, 
Seal, um, I don't know if he has the water moves. I'm just going to bite Seal, hopefully cause a bit of flinching. Excellent. Uh, let's just use another bite. Didn't take care of Seal. Flinched. Let's just use Ember. See, it's not very effective. So, he does have that somewhat resistance to fire with his Pokemon. He's going to be sending out Jugong. I believe Jugong is one of his key players. So, um, yeah, the bite trick is going to come in handy here. Um, hopefully, we're going to keep causing flinch. Edbutt. Really? Edbutt? Flinch. Now, I don't know if Jugong has rest. Um, I'm hoping not. Otherwise, we're in a bit of a tight situation. Um, bite? Are you kidding me? Wow. Um, okay, third one. Piloswine. Interesting. Piloswine has three weaknesses. Yeah. It's weak to fire, water, and fighting. To be weak to three tight things? Very weird. Obviously, Palace Rain does gain an evolution and becomes quite awesome in later generations, but not here. So, with quick work of Palace Rain, gain all that experience, and we're done. Price defeated. That's seven badges we have now, and we're almost done, Jojo, guys. Received the Glacier Badge. Badge reaches the special stats of Pokemon. It also lets you use Whirlpool to get across Whirlpools. And this is a gift for him. We received TM16. Chains Icy Wind. Now, there is better ice moves out there. Icy Wind is a good one to start with if you catch the likes of a Swinub. So on and so forth. Professor Elm. Gold, how are things? I called because something weird is happening with the radio broadcasts. They were talking about Team Rocket. Gold, do you know anything about it? Maybe Team Rocket has returned, no? That just can't be true. Sorry to bug you, take care. Why don't we open our radio and see what's going on? What does he mean by radio broadcasts and Team Rocket? Let's find a radio channel. Ahem, we are Team Rocket. After three years of preparation, we have risen again from the ashes. Giovanni, can you hear? We did it. Where is our boss? Is he listening? It seems that Team Rocket has taken over the Goldenrod Radio Tower. So, in the next episode, we'll be going back to Goldenrod City and chasing the rockets out of the Radio Tower. See you guys then.